Hey everybody, bit of rock and roll to get us going tonight. I am going to just get you started tonight and Ms Phillips is going to run us through a presentation. Talk about a few things, catch up on a few ideas and just remember that gold rocks. That's why we're in the business. Gold does rock. We've been doing quite a bit of work on getting ready for our upcoming functions over the last few days. So that's been very cool. Okay, I will hand over to Ms Phillips. Good evening everyone. What a treat for tonight and thanks for joining us. Hi Brent, happy Aussie day to everyone. Yes, there we go. Australia, happy Australia day. Yesterday I saw a young, young girl at the park and she had a, an Australia t-shirt on. So that's one of the beauties of the Australian culture that we like to shorten our words, Australia. So I hope you've had a great weekend and uh, a, a recharging of the batteries, a real appreciation of our Australian freedoms and the beauties of our land and what can be achieved uh, over the next years here. So, Gold Monday, 27th. So, yes, now I'm going backwards. Now I need to go forward. Here we have our Brains Trust. Lots of people have been contributing and helping us to go forward. We thank each one. Each one is valuable. We have two sponsors featured tonight, Love Day Vehicle Lubricants, Doug and Jenny, part of the Brains Trust, and Brad Cerevalli in Adelaide, BJS Urban and Equine Fencing Solutions. Both uh, really help our merchant program. So, opinion only. We are expressing our views as affiliates only. This is not company policy. What we work out is the best way for us to make some money from this program. We do not represent the company Carrot Buzz International in any way. We thank the company for what they provide to us and then we work the program as much as possible. Carrot Buzz International presentation. This, a lot of these images are from their professional presentation. Carrot Buzz is a German company, success made in Germany, founded in 2011, in particular in Stuttgart, and then have expanded into 120 countries and still growing. They have increased the number of partners. By partners, I'm figuring they mean affiliates, so those who actually work the program. Uh, it may include customers as well. 7,000. 730,000, rapidly growing. The numbers we heard recently were growing by 30,000 a month. So that's really cool. Global offices in Hong Kong, Singapore, Dubai, Slovenia, Romania and Spain. Uh, Brent saying there's nearly 900,000. That's very good. IT offices in Germany, Bangladesh, Romania and more to be established. I have found their, their offices, no matter who I speak with, have been really helpful. So if you ever ring carrot bars and then you pick English, then you'll be diverted across to the Romanian call centre and they have been so helpful. So here is Harold Size. His promise is that Carrot Bars and Gold Standard Bank will continue promoting and defending the financial freedom and the security of every, every human being independently in a decentralised manner. That was an interesting comment, decentralised, meaning not relying on the bank, the boss, your government. So decentralising, having less reliance on, on what has traditionally been um, our culture. So our digit, our future is unlimitedly digital. 
rests on a solid foundation of pure gold at the same time. So we're looking forward and, and but looking back because of the solid foundation of gold. He was awarded Senator of Global Economic Network a couple of years ago because of his work with gold and financial security. His mission, or our mission, Carrot Bar's mission, and what we all buy into is to bring pure gold to all people, to prevent debt, to work around debt, to pay debt off, to be free from debt, to help millions of people find financial freedom and to guide people into the digital finance world to be prepared for the future. I read somewhere that um, what they are providing is like a bridge from what used to be the old financial program, the old financial system and bridging across into blockchain and the new way and providing that for us. And that, um, for me, it was a really lovely analogy and vision. Because gold in human history has had a huge attraction uh, in Egypt, all around the world, pharaohs, kings, jewellery, sign of power and wealth. The gold standard, we often hear this term, the gold standard, going back to the gold standard because we don't have a currency in the world that has a gold standard as its standard. And what that means, so this is a, a note from America and there are two interesting areas there. One in that first red area, the certificate. This certificate is a legal tender. And the bid at the bottom says that $100 in gold coin. So if you took that note into the bank, you could actually walk out with gold because there was a gold standard and it was exchangeable for gold, that paper. So as, as people and culture and, and merchants all around the world used to buy and sell items and then carry gold because gold was such a reliable form of exchange, it was heavy and it was easy to steal and, and, and plunder and be the, the direction of of thieving and so on. So if you were on a camel and heading off somewhere, it was easy to jump you and, and get your gold. So that's why they went to paper. I mean, over many years, many, many thousands of years. And then that, but that paper was worth the gold that was um, exchangeable for. And that's what the gold standard means. That bit at the bottom, $100 in gold coin. That, and if you were the bearer of that, piece of paper, you could go and demand $100 worth of gold and walk out the bank. That's what gold standard actually means. But as we probably know, in 1971, Richard Nixon was the president at the time and he cancelled that convertibility from, from paper into gold of the US dollar. And that's when our inflation started to get away. Uh, gold became more valuable and paper currencies around the world. It's much easier now to just print more money because uh, it isn't exchangeable for gold and a bank doesn't have to have the equivalent amount of gold in store if someone walked in and wanted to exchange it. So that, that event there by Richard Nixon is significant for us all these years later. Gold is stable. You see here, this to me is a really powerful visual. So we have the Model T Ford on the left, exchange, um, uh, worth $645 or a kilo of gold. And that would have been the top of the range vehicle 100 years ago. And fast forward to now, and there's the top of the range for, that's in US dollars, $40,000. So in round figures, that'll be $70,000 vehicle. Again, still a, a kilo of gold. That's the power of gold, that it holds its value and 
and what you can exchange it for and buy. You've probably noticed there's some Australian currency, $20, and over the years, it buys less and less groceries in your trolley. Quite disturbing, actually. Um, not only is there 2.2 in inflation every year, which doesn't sound very much, but if you compound it year by year, it actually adds up to a huge amount. And over the last 20 years, that compound effect of 2.2% inflation has actually meant a, a rise of over 50% in prices. So while it sounds a small amount, it is actually affecting every one of us every day. Here are some experts. Robert Kiyosaki wrote Rich Dad, Poor Dad, and was actually buying gold at quite a young age, interestingly, and Alan Greenspan, who was the CEO of the, what does the FED actually stand for, Derek? FED, the Fed, when? Federal Reserve. Bank, so federal it's a bank. Federal Reserve, it's not a bank. It's, it's not a reserve. bank, it's just a Federal Reserve. Okay, I'm not really up on that, but obviously he's well known around the world and he's promoting gold as well. This was really interesting. This was in Amsterdam and Jan and I were standing at the counter at this hotel and they obviously are not taking cash. They either want some sort of wallet on your phone or payment by credit card. So cash has a limited future uh, was what I got from this. Now, at the moment, I haven't seen this in Australia. or well, certainly haven't taken a photo of this, but I thought this was significant because this is part of the future direction for cash, uh, which really means it's not particularly stable or welcome. Caritas does cash gold. So the cash gold there on the right, there's actually a thin sliver of gold in those notes and it is worth 0.1 of a gram all of those there there are others that have 0.2 or 0.4 and that's taking us back to a gold standard where you can exchange money for gold the classic gold cards you'll see there on the left the one gram the three gram and the six gram they are available as well from current bars. Aha, blockchain. This is worth Googling and, and educate yourself about what is blockchain and what does it mean. At, at the conference, at our Gold Rocks conference in a couple of months' time, we've actually got a blockchain expert coming because I think we really need to get our heads around blockchain. I've done a little bit of research, I understand a little bit, but this is gonna have a huge effect. It's a bit like the internet. If you remember the internet back in the 80s, uh, do you think the world and the businesses will take on the internet or not? While we were sitting on the sidelines wondering whether it would or not, it just came in that more and more people were using the internet and there are billions of users of the internet around the world today. So as we sit on the sidelines today and wonder, will blockchain come in and will it be useful? And who's going to use blockchain? It's going to come in and, and we need to be ready. So blockchain is often confused with Bitcoin. So Bitcoin was the first currency that was a digital currency and use blockchain. So a lot of people think of Bitcoin as blockchain, but it's not. It's two, two systems and one uses the Bitcoin uses blockchain technology. So the guy who invented or the person who invented Bitcoin actually set the pathway for a huge change in the way we do business, the way we preserve information, data, uh, who, 
who owns what, how much do you have in the bank, who owns the house that you live in, is it yours, is it someone else's, and, and how lawyers and bankers uh, and accountants keep all that information will be used, blockchain will be used for that sort of data protection. So fascinating uh, program of blockchain. Now I'll just go back because Carrot Bars has their own blockchain. So if we go back to Bitcoin, Bitcoin, the blockchain that Bitcoin was on was really slow. And if you would like to buy a house or something with Bitcoin, it actually takes about 24 hours to have that transaction go through. And that's why a lot of merchants won't use it or won't accept Bitcoin because they're not prepared to wait 24 hours to be paid. Will Bitcoin go up in value or down in value in that 24 hours? I don't know. So you, you might be happy to accept Bitcoin, but what is its value in 24 hours when that blockchain, that first blockchain actually goes through and it's all okay? The carrot bars blockchain, it's almost instant. So time, time was an issue with that first blockchain and carrot bars have addressed that. So let's have a look at the Carrot Buds universe. Carrot Pay. If you've purchased cash gold on for any of your packages at all, then you've used Carrot Pay as a payment method. So it's our online platform for cash gold transactions. And of course, it's part of the Carrot Buds world. Carrot Gold is the company founded in Singapore in 2015 and actually creates and distributes the cash gold notes. CarrotNet is the name of the blockchain that CarrotBars has actually designed. So it's a fabulous, quick, efficient um, blockchain that um, will support all of the functionalities for Carrot bars, firm basis for our KVC and business solutions. And those business solutions uh, will be revealed on the rest of this slide. K Merchant, when you buy gold, then you want to spend gold. And the K Merchant program is perfect for that, the spending of gold. Ecosystem for retailers and consumers. Buying and selling, eating, filling your car, having your hair cut, buying shoes, whatever it is. The, the whole ecosystem of K-merchants and being able to pay. KBC, BTC stands for Bitcoin and ETH is Ethereum. Uh, the, the WIM laptop actually uses the blockchain as well, the CarrotNet. It's the first laptop in the world using voiceover blockchain technology. And that means it's unhackable, no one can be looking into your into your bank accounts anywhere, any of your documents that you have, personal, private information is all protected. Email and data transfer encryption over blockchain. And they have a unique key that actually is the key to the whole system. And that key is also used in the K1 Impulse phone. First phone with voice over blockchain worldwide. Emily, Jeff Bezos of Amazon has just had his phone hacked and some very sensitive information. Not only was hacked, but uh, was spread around. So if you're listening, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Bezos, come and have a look at our phone. First phone with voice over blockchain encryption that means you and i can talk on our phone and no one not mr telstra not mr optus nobody can be listening in uh, any third parties so it's actually pretty special end-to-end -end encryption connected to carrot pay and carrot net the cem it, that stands for cash gold exchange machine you can, this is where you can actually exchange your KBC into gold. So any merchant that has these in their shop front, it's a bit like one of those exchange machines where um, 
you, you put your credit card in and you get money out or debit card or a coffee machine where you put money in and you get a coffee out. You, you can actually exchange KBC into gold here. You can buy and sell. So that's what the exchange meaning in the name and title of it means. Carrot bit is their own exchange where cryptos and fiats are traded and exchanged. If you've done any of that, that's pretty exciting. Particularly at the moment, you can buy the KBC at quite a low price. Let's have a look. Next one, the Carrot Pay is the online platform. This is a bit more information about Carrot Pay. I'm sure you've all used it if you've bought any cash gold and purchased any package or anything through Carrot Bars, you would have used Carrot Pay already. You can buy, transfer, and pay with cash gold. The exciting part about this is there'll actually be an app for your phone and then walking into a merchant so as the ecosystem for the merchants is built and spread then the carrot pay will become even more useful you'll be able to pay at the merchant you open a carrot pay account for free and you can actually send gold through the network pretty cool the carrot net is the name of carrot bars blockchain technology it's completely theirs so when they first had their KBC, their, their coins, their crypto coins, it was actually on the Ethereum blockchain. They've now been able to develop their own and are completely self-contained and, and have that functionality within carrot bars and not having to hire, pay, rent, whatever to another group. And it went live on September 15, 2019. So it's already up and running, which is lovely seeing, you know, that's part of their roadmap. And yes, that's another milestone that they have ticked and met. K1 phone and WIM connects over our current net blockchain and the K merchant transfers. The K merchant partners, they can, so if you know of a merchant locally, whether it's fish and chips or hairdresser or the fuel outlets, the merchant partners can choose the local currency as a payout. That's one of the great benefits of being part of the program is they can, you and I can pay in gold and the merchant can actually be paid in the paper currency that he wants. They can all be selected there in the merchant dashboard. The moment the downfall is that there is a minimum of 500 USD payout or you have to wait for seven days. You also need a pretty rigorous KYC on the merchant side. So they need to certainly prove who they are, what they are, uh, no money launderers and, and, and terrorists allowed. <laughs> which is pretty cool too. The blockchain, the whole system is working on this fabulous blockchain, the carrot net, and there are fees involved. Obviously, when the KBC was on the Ethereum blockchain, there was rent paid. Just like using somebody else's garage to park your car, you pay them rent. Well, Carrot Bars was paying Ethereum to have the KBC on their blockchain. Well, now any, anyone who wants to come and use the Carrot Bars, Carrot Net blockchain will pay rent, will pay fees, and, and we can benefit from the fees that will be paid. Uh, so another source of income, I guess. Uh, anyone who's read Robert Kiyosaki and knows that multiple sources of income are very good. And obviously, continual increase the gold base and our K's, KBC coins. That needs to be updated. But anyway, imagine the potential and the prospect of the KBC. It's all gone through to KBC. If, if you're a recent affiliate, then any of the packages that you purchased up until December would have had free KCB in them. They've now all been transferred to KBC, just so you know. The blockchain on the carrot bit is our own exchange and it facilitates the exchange of cash gold, 
into fiat currency, our KBC coin, as well as any of the other well-known digital currencies. So KBC is more than a cryptocurrency. It actually holds a complete paradigm shift. If you think about how certainly my parents uh, went to, went, either they did study or they didn't. It, it was not expected back then. Um, both my parents did study um, to have their profession, but lots of people just hopped into something and stayed in that profession for 40 years. And that certainly has changed tremendously. And we're moving into a whole complete paradigm change, not only about jobs, but payments and blockchains and how we do business and our, um, the value of our privacy and the value of our security. Huge paradigm shift. The carat gold coin raised over 100 million, I would imagine that's euros, but anyway, to become one of the largest ICO, ICO stands for initial coin offering in history. So that actually was so fast it would have beaten Bitcoin, I think. KBC, as well as its growth, is based on gold from the Gold Standards Global Mining Network. We've covered the rest of that. Let's look at the original business. The ultimate nest egg is gold. And that picture on the right there, that would have been considered millionaire's territory, that I can only buy gold in big chunks and I can only buy gold if I have a lot of money, if I'm a millionaire already. And Carrot Bars has broken that down for us so that we can buy small, affordable increments of gold regularly. The four major benefits of a Carrot Bars account. You can start saving physical gold in small increments. They are the world leader in small increments of gold. 24 carat, 999.9% .9 pure gold. Number two, Carat Vans International puts you in a position to build a global business from the comfort of your home. So you can have a home-based business and all the tax advantages that come from that. Oh, there we go, significant tax advantages to owning a home-based business. If you've been in business, if you're self-employed, and you're familiar with the, the extra tax advantages that you get from having your own business rather than going to work and having a job, then these are transferred into a carrot bars business as well. And number four, gold is a phenomenal insurance in unstable economic times. So many people are predicting not only unstable um, economic times ahead, but really horrific economic times. If you know anything of history and know the huge depression back in 1929, uh, they reckon will blow that out of the water. So any goal we have will help to buffer you and I. This is gold. For the members right now, it's really easy. Register, it's free and it's so easy to register. It's quick and easy. Send them your link. The KYC is a little hard, and that's really to protect everybody. So do persist with KYC. If we can help you, let us know, because the KYC is the key to, to proving that you're one of the good guys. Know your customer, that stands for. So that means proving yourself with your licence and... What's the other one? It's to... Ability. Yes, um, proof of address. Yep, okay. And it is worth whatever name is on your licence, whatever full name, letter for letter, use that as the identity that you register. So rather than skip a middle name or just put an initial, if there's a middle name on your licence, put it in as you register. It will save you. Buying cash gold, obviously, then you're going to register for carrot pay, so you can set up your carrot pay account and, and so forth. Set up auto exchange, a gram a month, whatever it is that is in your budget and in your mindset. Check out the multi packs that suit you. So they're 
quite new. And the multi-packs add an additional two income streams. If you've had a look at the compensation plan, there's about seven income streams there and the multiplex add another two. Let's have a quick look. Start at 75 euros per month or 150 euro one-time purchase, all the way up to 7,500 euros. Multiplex add the additional two income streams and cash gold is one of them and e-points is the other. The e-points are spendable immediately, as long as you, like you, you can accrue them and buy a product. And you can ask us for an explanation of the benefits. There's an optional gold miner. So you might have heard the term the Bitcoin mines and, and somebody mining for Bitcoin. Uh, it's the same concept, 75 KBC per week set up in carrot bit. So I'll, I'll, I won't read all of that. Uh, get your head around it. You can go to uh, products um, and, and actually read through all of that yourself and see what's there and what you get. Yes, certainly with the price of KBC at the moment, uh, you can do that. So let's have a look at saving in gold. Paying yourself first is a fantastic concept from Carrot Buzz International and really encouraging you to pay yourself first. So setting up auto exchange, go to product purchase. Uh, obviously that, that white background is significant there, auto and special exchange. There are a number of decisions to make as you set this process up. So the first one is the how often recurring rhythm. So do you want to purchase weekly, bi-weekly or monthly? That's your first decision. Second decision is will you spend a certain amount of money or do you want to buy a certain weight in gold? So there's a fixed amount which means spending an amount of money and there's the gold card which refers to the weight in gold. So I'll have a look at both of those and explore both of them for you. So the first one is if you decide to spend a fixed amount of money, it might be your budget that you work out how much. So you choose fixed amount and then you type in that will be euros. So if you work out how much in Australian dollars your budget is either weekly, bi-weekly or monthly, and then convert that into euros. And that's what will be taken from your credit card uh, at the recurring option that you've chosen. So let's have a look as if you decide to buy a certain amount of gold, obviously you're gonna choose the option there, gold card. Then you can choose what size of gold, is it one gram, 2.5 or five? And then how many of them? You want one of them, you want two of them, you want 10 of them, whatever. So, uh, all your decision and up to you. And then you go through the checkout process, which you'll be familiar with if you've purchased anything. Same checkout process. It does say there that only MasterCard and Visa credit cards can be used, and the Carrot Bar's prepaid MasterCard cannot be used. So choose another one of your credit cards. If you have a 3% bonus code in place, it will not be reflected in your auto and special invoice. Instead, we are charging you the preferred price according to the dashboard. So as gold goes up or down, then that will be reflected in what you are charged. It also means as gold goes up and down, if you've chosen a certain amount of money to spend each week or you know, whatever recurring rhythm, then that will be reflected in how much gold actually ends up in your wallet. So it is worth setting up your auto and special exchange as soon as you can. Upcoming events, we're really excited about this. Gold Rocks Conference, we had a fantastic group of people come to Edelong Beach last year and we're looking forward to another fantastic, bigger, more people coming to Caloundra. Learn heaps, great speakers, book now. So you can actually register your interest by going to goldrocks.me and then look for events. 
and let us know. Saturday the 13th and Sunday the 14th of June are the two training days at Caloundra Events Centre. And if you watch any of the other podcasters from around the world, Lucky Rico, if you've listened to him, you would have heard that he Kalindra. is on his way. What's that? Kalindra. Yes, Kalundra. <laughs> the Kalundra Event Centre. We need to get him a bit more aussie fi don't we? Kalundra Event Centre, just a bit north of Brisbane. You can fly into Brisbane, you can fly into the Sunshine Coast and come and have a great weekend. If you are flying in, realise that if you come a little early on Friday, we're having a very special lunch and that's for 50 people only and it is on a first-in basis. So if that is of interest to you, make sure you've booked your accommodation, book your flights and book in for the special lunch and on Friday. Friday night is uh, for everybody and, uh, and we can have a meet and greet together as well. The Saturday will be all day Saturday, all day Sunday, great international speakers and everyone is welcome, whether you've had a, a Carrot Bars account for ages or whether you're just new or whether you're just checking us out and would like some more information. Saturday night will be dinner and entertainment. Again, everyone's welcome. Uh, if, if you've come to Queensland with your spouse and your spouse is either in Carrot Bars or not, then everyone's welcome to the Saturday night. The Calandra Events Centre is a magnificent centre and will seat nearly 900 people. But you need to book your accommodation. Uh, here's a map. So there's the Events Centre Calandra, pretty central. And anywhere on that map is probably within 20 minutes, probably not even that. So really from Batinia, and to the north, Palmview, to the west, Pelican Waters, to the south, anywhere in there, uh, come and stay, book your accommodation and come on down. So also promoting the Gold Rocks monthly get-togethers, the third Sunday each month, that's at 96 Sumners Road in Sumner. It's a western suburb of Brisbane. So we get together a, a great social time at 12 o'clock have lunch there it's an ALH pub and that means any of your your Woolworths gift cards uh, will actually work there and one till three is the gold info session thank you for joining us tonight and does anyone have any questions there's been quite a lot of negative press on social media just like any any topic that's controversial or or current, you'll get the, the people who know what they're talking about and lots of people who want to comment and they don't know anything about it. So please be really discerning on, on who you follow, who you listen to, and don't get distracted. Go back to Harold size, listen to his YouTube, listen to those who have a close, strong relationship with him and listen to them rather than listening to some of the naysayers and the haters out there so just protect yourself as with any <laughs> negative information any questions lucky rico exactly he he's so cool he'll he'll pull apart a lot of the negative press and he'll he'll actually talk about the negative press what it means what it does mean and what it doesn't mean, what it could mean and what it can't mean. He does that really well. Any questions? Doesn't seem to be any questions. Thanks so much, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your night and we shall see you on the golden beaches of the world and next Monday night.